Hey guys, so I recently went on holiday to England um, to visit my family. For those that don't know, I live in Spain, but I am British. Um, so I went to Devon, which is where most of my family is from. And I only went for a week, but I did a lot of shopping, um, mainly toiletries, because I just find that I can get a lot more for my money and much better brands in England. Okay, so I'm, I'm going to start with toiletries because that's what I got the most of and go through it. So the first thing I got, um, I'm going to start with boots, is the Tea Tree and Witch Hazel Exfoliating Pads. Um, the Tea Tree and Witch Hazel range had a three for two on, so why not? So I got these. I got the Tea Tree and Witch Hazel Cleansing and Toning Lotion, although it's not a lotion, it's a, a liquid. Uh, all these products smell amazing, by the way. And I also got, which I took out the box to save space, was the Tea Tree and Witch Hazel Facial Pore Strips. So you get six in a box. So just like that, I haven't tried these yet, but there's six of them. Um, so I got that from the Boots range, but then from Boots I also got the Yes to Tomatoes Clear Skin Detoxifying Charcoal Facial Wipes. They were also on three for two, so um, I got three packs. Um, I think they were $1.99 each, so I ended up getting 30 wipes for um, $3.98, um, which was exactly the same price as the big packs. Um, but they didn't have the big packs in the de detoxifying charcoal ones. So I wanted to try them out. From Boots, I also got this brand, which was also in the sale. I like sales. Um, the Maui Moisture. I got the um, Strength and Anti-Breakage Agave Shampoo. Um, it's for chemically damaged hair. I dye my hair every three months, so I thought this was the best one to get. I got the shampoo and conditioner. And I also got the Thicken and Restore with Bamboo Fibres Blowout Mist for weak and brittle hair. So these were all in the sale. They were originally £8.99, um, and I paid £5.99 for each item, so they're £3 off. Um, which I thought was quite good and by the way these items smell amazing um, then I went into TK Maxx I actually went into two TK Maxx's um, and I got a few beauty items from there so I got the Sukin oil balancing clarifying facial toner tonic just there it was originally 9 99 and I got it for 4 99 so that's a bargain. I love Sukin products. Um, also, I got purifying facial mask from Sukin. That was originally eleven ninety five, and I got it again for four ninety nine. I was happy with that. I also got this rose hip infused charcoal body scrub um, from Natural Sense. I've never heard of the brand before, but it's it's all natural that one and this was $4.99 it doesn't say the original price um, in Holland and Barrett I only got one item which I'm actually really surprised about because I love Holland and Barrett um, I just got some toothpaste so this is from Dr Organic the aloe vera toothpaste I love Dr Organic toothpaste um, and then we have the body shop, but I have a few more items to get, so. So from the body shop, I got vitamin C glow boosting microdermabrasion. That one. I haven't tried this yet, but I'm looking forward to it. I also got the vitamin C skin reviver instant so smoother. I've tried this and this serum is amazing and it smells amazing I also got the British Rose instant glow body butter 
for those of you that have seen my last review. I did the British Rose face mask and I love it. So I thought it was only fair to get more Rose products. And talking of British Rose, I also got the shower gel. And makeup wise from the body shop, I got some eyelash curlers, which by the way, are really good. These were five pounds. Um, I've been using the same ones, um, or I've been using a cheap one from like a pound shop for about five years. And by using these, I could definitely notice a difference. I literally have to curl once instead of 15 times. Um, I also got the Body Shop um, Mascara. This is Lash Hero in just Madagascar Oinks 01. Um, just black, basically. So I got that. I think this was £11. I also got a lip liner or lip definer shade is this I don't know what shade this is but I will link it down below um, and then I got two matte lip liquid matte lip liquid lipsticks I got two very similar colors as you can see they're very similar but I like my lips natural colors like these so this one is Nairobi Camellia 034. I've used this one before and I love it. And this one I haven't opened yet, but it's the Tape Orchid 020. So they are slightly different, but also very similar. <laughs> so that's everything I got from the body shop and that's all the toiletries I got. Um, so now I'm going to move on to the other things I got. I tell a lie. There's a few more toiletry slash cosmetic slash things in this haul. So I'll move on to them. Moving on to Neil's Yard. There's a Neil's Yard shop in Exeter in Devon, which I was so thankful for. I love Neil's Yard products. So I couldn't go in or couldn't go past without buying, obviously. So I got the Arnica Salve, which is just amazing for tired muscles. And then I also got the Warming Salve, which is very similar to um, like Tiger Balm or um, Reflex Spray or something, but all natural, not complaining. I also got, moving on to non-toiletry stuff, I got a tote bag from Neil's Yard with a bee on it and it just says, be lovely, help save the bees. And this was only £4 and I'm like, I need it, you can never have enough tote bags. Moving on to Urban Outfitters, I got quite a bit in Urban Outfitters, I'm not going to show you the clothes. Um, like here holding them up. I'm just gonna put a clip in the in a minute showing you what I got from both Urban Outfitters, New Look and Hollister. Um, but I will show you this beanie in this clip. So I got this beanie from Urban Outfitters. It's Adidas and it was in the sale at £10, originally down from 18 So I was happy about that. It's just this burgundy colour and in inside it's like fleece, like blue fleece and I love that. I love my beanies. Moving on, I got two books. Um, I don't actually read books that often but I saw these and I thought, why not? So the first one is from, dear god I hope I say this right, Yumi Sekugawa. And it's the little book of life hacks, how to make your life happier, healthier, and more beautiful. So I haven't read many pages from this book. I've probably read about six, but it just looks amazing. And the pictures and the design is just amazing. For example, show an easy one to show. Uh -huh. Eight double duty makeup tools, for example. 
and these are the pictures I just think it's amazing so definitely get that book this was 14 99 in Urban Outfitters and then also from Urban Outfitters I got this book the subtle art of not giving a fuck looking forward to reading this so there's no pictures in this one which I'm disappointed about I love pictures but yeah I think this is going to be a very interesting read so I'll let you know how I get on with that one and I will move on to the clothes um, so I will insert the clips here guys enjoyed this video um, I will try and find links to everything and um, whatever I can find links for I will link in the down bar so check that out if you're interested in anything that I showed in this video um, please like and subscribe and I will see you in the next video bye guys